to be honest, uh, I think with with the way um, with the way the new CBA is is is, um, is going constructed, I I feel that um, player development is something that we have to pay attention to, and so uh, whatever young players or draft picks we have, we we just have to pay attention to it. Um, and, you never know, you know, like you never know when uh, you're gonna hit with that or or something that pans out to help your team in um, in any kind of way. Um, I want to say 23 is an asset, but you know we concentrate on finding uh, that player, uh, the best possible player that we can at um, where we're picking. The, I mean, are you in a position where you need someone you're gonna pick at 23 to help you right away? Or are you more? Given the status of your team, more comfortable taking a player who could play in Europe for a couple of years? Yeah, well, comfortable either way. You know, like uh, just a, I think a player that um, we feel has um, some upside or um, there's something that that player does, you know, like that translates to the NBA and, and uh, we can use on our team, whether it's now or the future. So um, we're, re we're really open minded uh, when it comes to this pick. It's not. Very often you see um, um, in the 20s where guys come and contribute right away, but you know, uh, sometimes we say uh, you never know, and um, we're, we're excited about this draft and this process.